and welcome back to the Event Design Toolkit YouTube channel where we help you design brilliantly crafted and lovingly curated DIY events. I am so excited about today's video. We are bringing you the huge Instagram trend, Trash to Terra Cotter. Because I wanted this to work for weddings and large events, I decided to use some of my smaller, more affordable and easily accessible centerpiece items. First up, I had to use these bud vases from Ikea. They are only 50p and whenever I head to Ikea, they have loads of them. Next up, I decided to use two of my favourite bud vases from Wedding of My Dreams. I love the shape of both of these and thought they would be perfect with a ceramic finish. I wanted to give one of my favourite candlesticks a try. These are also from Ikea. To create the ceramic effect paint, you need to add baking soda to any water-based acrylic paint. Baking soda until you get a thick, fluffy consistency. I've heard different ratios when talking about paint to baking soda. I would say it depends on the paint you're using. So keep adding the baking soda until you're happy with the consistency. If it goes too thick and dry, just add some more paint to it. This effect looks amazing in any colour. I chose to use white because I'm going to use these items on a white Christmas table styling. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on that video. I tried to dye with a sponge paintbrush but I wasn't happy with the overall finish so I went back to using a standard paintbrush. Lay the paint on thick, making sure you give a full thick coverage on each layer. I gave them two thick coats, leaving around an hour, two hours in between each coat. Just make sure the first coat is fully dry before you paint the other. If you have a vase with lots of detail or texture, make sure you really dab the brush in to get into all those tiny detail areas. I totally forgot to show you these fish bowls at the beginning of the video, but I decided to give these a paint also. I'm not a huge fan of fish bowls, but oh my god, I was so in love with these once painted. I'm actually going to use them to do a dried floral display. So again, make sure you are subscribed because there will be a video for this and I'm pretty sure it's going to be a stunner. And that is it. Once they are dry, they are ready to use. I would say if you're using them for a bigger bin or boxing them away somewhere, maybe give them a spray with a matte air clear protection just to make sure there's no damage. But if you're just using them in your home, then they are ready to go. I hope you found this video useful. Please let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know what help you need when designing your wedding or event. Make sure you've subscribed because I will be bringing you weekly event design videos with hints, tips, DIYs and expert interviews. Thank you for watching.